slash roaster, air fryer, and so much more. But K Kelly is back, and Kelly, this is the season. Obviously, we're doing more baking yes. than we do the rest of the year. True story. These are so stinking cute. I'm, I'm telling, telling you, <laughs> even if you don't use them, I was telling Kelly, I just They're want... like a photo shoot. They, they are. so I'm cute. Just, I just want these in my oh, sorry. kitchen. <laughs> I'm, I'm serious. I just want these in my kitchen yes. because, you know, people just grab them. They go, oh, they're so adorable. Yes. Well, it's actually a set of three. You're getting $24, them all. All of them. Yes. They have these individual boxes, which I think are darling. So you get this wonderful deer design, the snowflake, and then these cute little presents, 676391. And they're all individually boxed. All individually boxed. For three gifts. For three gifts. But if you go on Pinterest, or if you search social media, this is like a really big trend in the kitchen right the now. The stamps and the rolling They pins. are. It's like a whole separate hot category yeah. right now. Well, it makes you look like a Pinterest mom when you're not really one. Yeah. No, it's really <laughs> true. Because it really makes you be able to bake with all these beautiful cookies really easily. So I'm going to use the, the presents, but you can use whatever dough of your choosing for Christmas at my house we always do sugar cookies right, absolutely. but whether you like gingerbread molasses yeah. chocolate chip whatever you want to do you're gonna roll it out with your traditional rolling pin and then you can just take your little um, this is the presents and you can just give it a press and it's like a little stamp and it's like a little stamp oh, look at that. but it goes all the way across Isn't that wild? and then you can take and you can see the presents there right, and then, and then you can just it. yeah you just cut any shape whether you want it to be a little holiday bell whether you want it to be a little a star right. and then you bake it off and you have these adorable cookies and I'll show you what we did down here with the snowflake so there's the presents uncooked and look at the snowflake all Super we did was cute. add a little glaze and some cinnamon and then there's Isn't the present so it's easier to see at home but look at how cute that is adorable? Hey, this is your first airing remember it is a set of three and even if it's I meant what I said even if you just keep these on your counter they're just so adorable oh, they're adorable Horrible. Aren't they cute? And even for the little girl in your life, like my, my niece Lexi has like, I, I can't say, you know the brand name that I'm talking about, that Melissa and, you know, uh, fill yes, in the yes, blank. Yes, 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 And she, so she has Look like that whole cute. little kitchenette suite. Yes. So this would even be cute. You know how kids always want to get involved when mom's making cookies, even if it's just for the big kids and the little kids. And little truth, you don't have to make the own dough. I mean, you know how you Oh yeah, buy you can store? buy the pre-bought uh, dough. I was going to say, get the little so cookies. this makes kind of that so pre-bought pre you know, dough. homemade. It, it does. It makes it gourmet. It makes it look uh, fancy. It makes you look like you spent all that extra time in the kitchen when in reality all you did was buy the little rolling pins. Now what's cute fun? about the little rolling pins is you're getting three and then they're individually boxed. So you could give the little presents you away. Could. Uh, you could keep the reindeer and you could, you know, give the snowflakes. Look at the little gifts. And when you glaze them and do a little cinnamon or a little uh, powdered sugar, they become, they even pop out more. Thank on the dough, you. yeah, you can see that there. I mean, they really are adorable. So sweet. You know, I like to bake. It's just, it's it's time consuming, it, it right? Is. When you want to do all these little fancy designs and you want to cut here and sprinkle there and it's do. True. I like that, you know, that sort of uh, familial memories. Yeah. But at the end of the day, I don't have the time to do it now. When I have my little, and they're just little rolling stampers. No, they're so. But you can sweet. do all the dough, and then you can take any cookie cutter. Right. And I'm so mad at myself because yeah. I have a goat cookie cutter. And so I could have had a goat cookie with a little <gasps> present roll. Oh, I mean, whatever it's, you, you can get, That's you can cute. get Star Wars cookie cutters. You can get HSN you can. cookie cutters that say, I mean, you can get any cookie cutter known to man and then you can it's just adorable. roll, you see my dough. And then I'm just stamping across it and you can see the presents there. How Look sweet. at how cute, it goes all the way across. There's my dough rolled out and then you I can know. see any shape, whether it's a star, a bell, a reindeer, a circle, and then you just cook cut them out and you go just bake them off but like that. But it's so funny because you know you're, you're how you, cute you want to really jazz up even that pre or that store bought dough. This does it. This does it. And it makes you look like Kelly said makes you look like a Pinterest, a Pinterest mom. mom or, Pinterest you know, grandma. But, Pinterest grandpa. Right? Pinterest Why dad. <laughs> and it's so easy. Remember you are getting the set of three. So it's a deer design. There's our snowflake. 
fabric and there's that great little present all with those individual bow and go boxes whether it's secret santa whether it's for the little girl in your life whether you're someone like me i'm just looking at this and i'd want to decorate with these i would just keep these out on the counter during the christmas season because i think they're so sweet they're so adorable so even if you don't use them from a functional standpoint oh, so just, how about like a photo shoot you're absolutely we did an old-fashioned so photo cute. shoot with my kiddos um and they were making cookies with santa so all you do is you take your store-bought dough or you take your regular joel you roll it out as thick or as thin as you'd like to do it you can see there i add a little bit of flour just so the rolling pins don't stick by the way these are wooden so they're hand washed so i wouldn't throw these in your dishwasher just a little tip for you and then you can see there's the little reindeer stamp and it's so much more vibrant at home on camera it's hard sometimes to see that stamper but when you get that little reindeer pattern coming across there look at how cute that is and this is like prancer so and dancer cute. and vixen, vixen and donner and rudolph i don't know mom i, I <laughs> need to good I, I got like five of them so i think yeah. we're in good shape I'm and you can impressed. use any shape you want now right and then you just stamp it and maybe you're the grandma that makes the cookies for all the co-workers or you're making them uh, for your neighbors but now i have my little stamped cookie my little stamped sugar cookie and again when you add a little glaze and a little cinnamon at the end that pattern just pops and it becomes a really sophisticated cookie a cookie you might not have been able to create sort of on your own and now you have these beautiful little rolling pins to make life easy and you know as Shannon mentioned at the end of the day you know I like to do things the easy way as well I get the little store-bought dough Why not? but you can get the gingerbread dough you can see here we've got the molasses dough and Sweet. all we did was added a little bit of powdered sugar at the end to make them pop. Oh, look at how that just makes it jump Isn't that right cool? Out. Isn't I mean, this neat? looks like a professional, sort of maybe a professional, uh, you know, bakery baked it, your cookies, it, and you can say, no, I made these myself. Well, <laughs> you know, I love Dash as a brand name here at HSN, and they're so super cute. I mean, they really are. I know we are busy. 676391. We did not bring in a lot of these for the holiday season, so you're looking at that five pay flex pay to get it at home, and in fact, everything in this show has that five pay flex pay so with that extended holiday return policy even make that store-bought dough look it just, like it homemade. Looks sophisticated, exactly. It, it, it just kind of, it, it's an extra treatment. It's just an extra nice treat. And they're old-fashioned looking to they me. They are. This reminds me of my Vintage. grandmother. You know, we don't have the old-fashioned rolling pins anymore. Hand wash, please don't dishwash these because they're right. wooden, right? And right. I mean, these are legit. These are nice uh, and wooden, so you're going to use your regular rolling pin to roll yeah. out your dough. And then, so I mean, cute. if you want to double over it, you could do little um, presents, maybe oh with, not? and then look, we've got the <gasps> snowflakes oh, coming Flakes. through. I mean, really, how, cool. how cute is that? Nice. And then you have this, the, the presents in the background. I like that idea of doing one or two. Any dough will work, so whether you like to do gingerbread cookie dough. I will say on the lighter doughs, you can see those stamps a little bit more. Yeah, you can. Um, but like this one, we did this one was a darker dough, and you can see like the little packages and yeah, stuff, and cute. adding a little powdered sugar helps. But I mean, that looks like a professional bakery, it, doesn't it? Does. It does, and they're gonna, they're gonna wonder how you did it. They're gonna <laughs> wonder where you got so them. Cute. The set of three with those individual boxes, truly bow and go. It's such a fun gift for the chef or the chef wannabe, whether you bake a little or bake a lot, even sure. for the little girl, little granddaughter or, or daughter in your oh, life. What a great idea. Because I mean, they're just, they're just well, but the and, right size. And they're small. I know. So, I mean, they, this is not going to take up a lot of room no. in terms of storage. In fact, you could store this with your Christmas items. You could. And they're nice and small. They're perfect for the season. Maybe keep one and gift two away. Keep two and gift you one could. away. Keep all three, yeah. whatever you want to do, now you're going to look like that Pinterest mom. You really will. I'll save you some cookies. <laughs> exactly. I mean, and the price is right, let's be honest. This so, is true. It, it's Dash. We love that name. Kelly, thank you for oh, coming. Oh, thank you. Save me some food over there I, later. Exactly. I know. It smells good, <laughs> it does doesn't smell it? Good. All right. Thank you, Kelly.